So here we are in Windows 8, but where's the start button? Let's head over to the desktop. All right, but the start button is still missing. I'm going to show you how to bring that back right now. So let's head over to Google. Let's type in Classic Shell. Now when we type in Classic Shell, we should have this first result, ClassicShell.net. We can click on that link and we can just simply download Classic Shell. And that will download the start button for us and install it automatically. So once we click on that button, it will automatically begin to download. When it's finished downloading, run the program and install it. Oh, and there's the installer. It just finished downloading. So we'll run this and we'll install Classic Shell. That'll bring up the wizard. We can just simply go through the wizard. Next, install. Give us a little prompt and we'll install Classic Shell. What's really cool about Classic Shell is that we can take it a step further and customize it even more. You'll see that it automatically pops up down here at the bottom. So here's our start button. But now let's type in Classic Shell. and We can go to Classic Start Menu Settings. And you know what? I'm actually going to change my start button or I'm sorry, I'm going to customize my start menu style and I'm going to choose the Windows 7 style just because I like that style the most. Once I do that I can click on OK and then you can see, boom, look at my start menu. So here it is, I found it. This is where your start menu button has been hiding all of this time. I hope you were able to follow along and you found this video helpful. Thanks so much. Leave me a comment.